Hey guys, welcome back. Cindy Williams, Wanderlust CEO. I have my good friend Daphne here from True Lux Destinations, who just graduated from Chris on vacation. You know I have the confetti queued for you. Daphne, how are you feeling today? I am feeling great. Well, I am. Thank you. How about you? I feel fantastic. And I'm so glad to be sharing your story today. Thanks for coming on the show. I want to start with where were you before? Where was your business before doing Cruise on Vacation? And where are you now? Well, we, I, I was actually going to invest into a franchise to sell cruises and ended up actually changing my mind. I went to YouTube and saw, I saw you on there and I watched so many of your videos. And I was like, wait a minute, I don't have to do a cruise fran franchise. I can build my own business from the ground up and it could be my own equity and all of that. So, and I was like, oh no. So after watching all of your videos, Cindy, I was like, I can do this. So um, I got it really excited, told my husband about it. And he was like, let's do it. And so we did it. And oh. best decision I've ever made. Yes. And <laughs> we, we're not even selling cruises yet. Like I just started um, setting up for the, with the vendors mm -hmm. and I've sold everything else, but cruises. So that's a whole nother story, but I, <laughs> I love that. and so you learn more beyond cruises after cr considering a cruise franchise. <laughs> and I'm glad you brought that up because that's one of the things people sometimes don't know about our company. We don't host agents. We take 0% of commission. Mm -hmm. We are training you how to either independently set up or how to set up in what we call a hybrid model. Um, with all of the information transparent, we work for you. We don't work for anyone else in the industry. So I know you saved over $10,000 by making that decision that you did in terms oh, yeah. of and, and investing in a back. franchise. And then you're not paying royalties. And there's a whole, like, understanding your setup from day one is so important, guys. Whether you work with us or not, do your research. We have a free masterclass on the different setups. But Daphne landed with us, which is amazing. I'm so glad because now you do have your own thing that you can take forward. What have been your biggest wins or celebrations since taking the program? Oh, Cindy, I've had so many wins surprising myself. I mean, we, I'm, I'm so excited because, okay, I'll talk about the most recent one. So the most recent one is Disney uh, College of Knowledge. Mm -hmm. I just finished that training. I started it last year in about May or June when I first, you know, started the program. And then I dropped off. I was like, Ooh, this is a lot. And it was I'm like, Ooh, hoo, hoo. but I will say a client called me last week. True story. She was like, Daphne, I want to go to Disney with my daughter and I need, I need a Disney trip for the summer. And I was like, Ooh, <laughs> I need to finish that training. I didn't tell her. And so maybe if she watches this video, she'll probably say, Oh, <laughs> she'll see it. But it's fine. I'm being transparent. I went ahead. I, I, I mean, Super Bowl day came this past um, weekend. My husband was like, I need your help with cooking food. And I'm like, I need to finish my Disney <laughs> training. I'm sorry. I got to finish my training. I and I mean, I did. I mean, we delegated. I, I was able to finish on Super Bowl Sunday and I am I'm happy about that. So That's and um, I felt kind of bad because I was like when she came to me about the trip, I I was thinking, I was like, when am I going to have the time to do this? So I pushed everything aside. I went ahead, pushed forward. Yes, I stayed up to two o'clock one morning. Well, that Saturday night, I stayed up to two o'clock in the morning. And my husband was like, what are you doing? I'm like, I got to finish this training because I'm not going to miss the sale of selling Disney. I mean, she gave me a budget. And it was a great I mean, I was like, why, why would I turn this down? So it pushed me. And so... Um, of course, not just just for her, I'll be able to sell Disney, but I'll be able to sell it, you know, for my family and for everyone else. So I'm just excited about that. So that's one win. My niche is group um, vacations for couples. So I recently, um, when I first started, we we had uh, created a trip to Barbados, and so Barbados uh, was our is our big trip, and we're actually leaving in June of this year to travel to Barbados. And so we have like 10 couples going. And so we started that um, last year. And of course we planned a trip a year, about a year ago. And so now we're going there. And so that's a, that's a win. Um, the other one is I recently, I'm doing a destination wedding as well. So, and that's huge. I'm like, Woo -hoo, all this, yes, it's a lot. So, and I wasn't even planning on doing destination weddings, but somehow, you know, with the couples and all of that, you don't have to be married to attend our, our group, um, 
vacations, but somehow we've gotten into destination weddings now. And so that's also something that we're doing. And that's also another big win that I'm excited about. And then I have like little sales trickle in here and there. I really try not to focus on individual sales. And I mean, I tell you, I had a, another client call me a few weeks ago and say, Daphne, can you book a trip to Las Vegas for me? I'm like, okay, sure. <laughs> okay. Let's go. I mean, my advice to everyone, I mean, I was thinking like, I'm doing things that I didn't think I, I could do. Mm-hmm. And people are just calling and they're like, oh, I need this. Can you do this? And they're, they're booking. Yeah. And, well, it, and it's, it's exactly what we say in the program. Your job isn't to know everything in the world. Your job is to know where to find the information, right? Mm-hmm. So then once you have that confidence and you have that roadmap to figure out you know what? I know how to sell Disney. Cindy has that roadmap right here in the program. You knew what to do. And now you're booking, you know, so much beyond cruises, which yes. was the original thought, right? Oh, Daphne, yes, that's it's, it's, it's busy. And I've had to turn down business. Like I've had to say, I don't have time. I mean, I, I, I mean, I have a busy schedule. I have four kids. I'm married. And so it's and my kids range from like 20 to three years old. So it's just, I mean, my, my life is just like here, there, everywhere. And so I have to uh, manage, you know, that's the only, that's the only thing that I struggle with is just like the time management, uh, planning those trips and just making sure. So, and when I do turn down, I just kind of, you know, bless and release and, and, you know, we keep moving and I, you know, just, I don't want to, we call that a high class problem to have so much business. You have to turn some away and there's nothing wrong with that. Because you have you want to create a business around your life, right? Like I, I have three kids too. You guys know I preach that in the program in terms of we're gonna do this to be happy, not to be burnt out or to give us ourselves another, you know, another corporate job that we don't want, right? So I love exactly. I actually love that you're turning away business and focusing on exactly what you want to do in the way that you want to do it. You're showing up for your business, you're showing up for your family. That's a double win. That means we've done everything right to to, to this point. Um, That brings me to mindset. You know, we have a lot of mindset in our program to really help you guys think like CEOs. How do I run my own business? How do I stay motivated? How did the mindset work impact you either in your life or business as you worked through the program? It pushed me to, it actually motivated me and it made me realize that I have to have a certain my mind has to be in a certain place to move forward and to be successful. And I also have to take a step back and say, well, even if I'm scared to fail, because that's what it's all about. Like Brandon says, you know, if you fall, if you fail, whatever, I mean, keep moving. That's great. Actually failures are success. And so if we keep that in mind, that's what I keep in mind for myself. I think about if even if I fail, Oh, well, I'm learning. still, I'm, yeah, I'm learning and I'm being, and it's still success because when you fail, you learn from that mm-hmm. and then you can pick up and keep moving and say, okay, dust yourself off. It's okay. Yes. We're shedding tears and, um, it's okay. Let's get, yeah. you know, get it back together and, and keep moving. So the mindset was so, I mean, that was, it's, it was like life changing because, and, and if people don't realize like that's like the basis, the starting point of changing your life is changing your mindset. So I, I mean, it helped me a lot. I love it. And I think, you know, a lot of people don't realize how complex this industry is. So what a lot mm-hmm. of people will do is they'll try to take the DIY method or the cheapest thing they can find. They jump in and then they're completely overwhelmed because there's no training. There's no support. There's no, I mean, can you imagine doing this without like a roadmap or without our team behind no. you? I mean, I'm sure it's possible, but like, how much time will it take? All of those things. And so I love having that mindset in there because even having the roadmap laid out, even having all of the tools, even having the best crew in the industry, there are still going to be days where you're like, Ooh, you know, I have this going on or that going on, but you have to have those tools to kind of bring yourself back to center. So sounds like uh, in your case, that worked perfectly because everything has come together. Now, Daphne, you have the unique perspective of being behind the curtain. Everyone wants to know what's it like to be in careers on vacation behind the scenes. A lot of people are on the outside looking in. What What's something you would want to tell someone who's on the fence about starting with us or maybe something we didn't we didn't share when you were looking into it that you were surprised by? Anything that you would want people to know coming from that new agent perspective of like, is this for me? Is this the thing I'm looking for? 
Yes. I mean, if people, it's not just for the love of travel, but if you want to help people, there's so many different niches that you can go into. Um, even with the modules, everything is just so organized. This is a great program. And I think that um, sometimes people say, you know, the travel industry or any industry is uh, over populated, that there's not a, a, a room for me. There is room for you. Even if you have two or three clients out of the whole entire year and they're just booking with you, that is room for you. Mm -hmm. And so don't think that the market is oversaturated and it's not because you may have uh, one client that's booking with you constantly or five clients or 20 clients. I mean, it doesn't matter. Do it. Um, especially if it's something that you're passionate about, you will not regret your investment. I I love it. I mean, I've made my money back. We've had over a hundred thousand dollars in sales so Ooh, far. And I have Oh, hang on. You know I got confetti here. for that. We're gonna double confetti. You're gonna not get rainbow here. and gold confetti. <laughs> yes. And so and everything is self-paced. Mm -hmm. So I love that because it took me a while. And and even I have these notebooks that are I have like about six notebooks with all the information. And I always can go back to it if if I need to go back to it. And then of course I can go onto the modules online and look. Yeah. And so, and then there's also support, you know, the support groups that we go into online. Um, the Wanderlust. And then you all do such a great, Valia, she was my coach. And so I love her. She's so sweet. And so she would offer advice. And so the coaching is, is great. Um, and then also you're able to, you all lay out the examples so well. So it's just, you know, not, not copy and paste examples, but you can, I mean, you can literally, it's just straightforward and I loved it. And it, and it helped me. I mean, I didn't know any, I'll be honest. I didn't know anything about the travel industry. All I knew, knew I want to do is just, uh, learn how to book travel for couples. And that was it. And that I knew that my husband and I, we love to travel and we like to travel with our kids. And so that was really important. And I was like, I want to share, you know, this knowledge with other people and just help them find their dream vacations. And, and that's all I wanted, wanted to do. And then I didn't realize like how much in depth travel, the travel industry is and how much information that, that need, you know, that we need to know. And I'm still learning. And that's just a part of life. We're all learning, even no matter what industry that you're in, we're, it's just constantly learning, learning, learning. And if you're not learning, 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 you're not moving forward, of course. I mean, so it's okay if, you know, if um, you sign up and you feel a little overwhelmed, <laughs> it's, it's okay. Or because to, we're your, all... to your point, like that's part of the journey. Like maybe you don't know how you want to show up and serve in the industry. Like you knew, like mm -hmm. I want couples, maybe groups, romantic trips, but then you got in and you were in, in this beautiful mastermind with other students and with the team. And you're like, maybe I could try that. Maybe I, and so it's an, it's an evolution process. And I think it's okay at the beginning, not to have all the answers as long as mm -hmm. in your heart, I always ask people like, do you want to do this for the right reasons? Are you passionate about travel? And do you want to have like a business you can build around your life? If the, those, the answer to those two questions is yes, proceed. We'll figure out the rest as you go through the program. I've never had anyone say that on a case study, Daphne, but that is so true because we have so many people that start thinking they're going to do one thing but then they get in, they understand the commission models, or maybe I don't really have a passion for what I thought I did. I want to do this and it evolves. And by the end of the program, you have a little more clarity on how to, how to move forward. Mm -hmm. Amazing. I agree. Well, guys, I want to tell you, go over and visit our website. If you're thinking about careers on vacation, this is a sample of Wanderlust campus. This is what Daphne was talking about. You get access to this forever. It doesn't go away after you graduate the program. Um, we have live classes. You work with real people. Those are little snippets of my team. We are real people working with you in this program. That's really what makes the difference. And we have the most case studies in the industry. Daphne, we're approaching up on like 230, 30 ish range is where you're going to fall in terms of case studies. So, which I think is uh, a testament just to how we help clients get actual results in this program. But that brings me to my last question. Would you recommend careers on vacation to someone who's thinking about being a travel agent, but specifically why would you recommend it to them? I, yes, definitely. Um, I would recommend it because you all are knowledgeable. And that was one of the main reasons why I signed up uh, for, for with you, uh, Cindy, because when I went on YouTube, I looked at everybody and what they were saying and Wonderlust, you were saying everything. 
every single thing that that it, everything made sense and so and i said oh my goodness she knows exactly what she's talking about and so the training the professionalism is all there so yes i definitely would recommend it i love it well my friend we're celebrating 30 years my team was like we got to get your 30 years in the industry video i'm like oh boy i don't know if i'm ready for that <laughs> But yeah, I've been, we've been doing this for a minute, but it's just, it's my joy. And this is exactly the part I love to get to is like when you're coming back and going, Cindy, here's what I did with what you taught me, right? So Daphne, again, I want to say congratulations, $100,000 in sales out of the gate. Now you know how to replicate that process in the most profitable way. You don't have to share or pay any royalties to a franchise and you yep. will be able to reinvest and put and do more marketing for your business and make it bigger and bigger year after year. So I'm so excited to watch how you evolve. We're going to see you over in the grad group. You're not going too far, but thank you for sharing your story today. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you guys next week with another amazing story. Have a good week. Cindy Williams here. If you like that last video, make sure you check out all of the other content on our channel. And if you want to follow along and travel with me around the world and see how I run my amazing travel brands and get some great tips on how to grow your own, make sure you check out that other content. I'm going to drop a couple videos here. Click those links. I'll see you next time. Bye guys. She's calling me.